Hi everyone and welcome to this video where I'm going to be unboxing a DVD box set for you. This is an old release, it's not new, I got it off eBay and it arrived this week. So I thought I'd show it to you and talk a little bit about the TV show that is in this box set. So this is Dungeons and Dragons, the complete series. It's a 1980s cartoon. And it's something that I watched regularly as a child in the 80s. It was one of my favourite cartoons. I did used to have the DVDs. They were released as volumes. I'll show you in a sec because they're inside here. They were released during the mid-2000s, I think. This box set is from 2004. I've never seen this box set before. It's like a... A limited edition. The one I used to have was like a slip case but this one's like a complete box that opens up which I'd never seen before and when I was repurchasing the series I thought I'd buy this version just because it was quite unique. It is a bit bashed up um, on the corners and stuff so I might try and find another one on eBay but this will do for the moment. So let me just show you the cover it's got Venger, which is the baddie of the series at the top there. And it's got all the heroes down here. It doesn't have the Dungeon Master on though, um, which is a little strange. That's the side. It doesn't even have the Dungeon Master on the back. The Dungeon Master was this little like wizardy type person that guided them through the realm of Dungeons and Dragons with all these riddles and things. So it's a bit strange he's not on any of the artwork because he's one of the most like memorable characters from the series. So on the back here it gives you a bit about the series in the blurb and then it lists some special features. Special features on these DVDs are absolutely incredible. If you're a fan of the show, the amount of behind the scenes stuff on these discs is really good. It even has like episode scripts if you put them in a computer and stuff. Uh, the fan commentary tracks are really good. The guy who does them is really knowledgeable about the show and there's other people on there, but the main guy, I can't remember his name now, um, but he's really knowledgeable about the show and there's some great behind the scenes stuff in it. So I thoroughly recommend listening to the commentaries once you've watched the episodes. So I'll open it up. And you can see what I mean about this box set being quite unique because usually it's just a slip case with the DVDs in. So on the opening cover here you get a list of all the DVDs and a list of the episodes that are on the discs. Then you've got the actual volumes. These were originally released separately and then they came out as a box set once all four volumes had been released. So I'll just pop that to one side and I'll show you the separate volumes. So we have Volume 1 of Dungeons and Dragons. It has the first seven episodes on it. It comes with fan commentary tracks on two of the episodes. And you can see that it's got other content as well. The disc inside has Hank on there with his bow. And Hank and Sheila on the front, the Avenger in the back. Then we have volume 2, which has Presto on the front of it. Again, there are seven episodes and fan commentaries on two of them, along with interviews and other things on there. The disc inside, again, has Presto on it. So this is volume 3. It has Eric and Diana on the front. Again, it's got seven episodes on it, along with two fan commentaries and more features. The disc inside has Eric on. He's like the coward of the show. <laughs> he was always very scared and didn't want to get into trouble and stuff. Oh, there's a the Dungeon Master. He finally makes an appearance on volume four with Bobby and Uni. So yeah, you probably recognize this character if you've never seen the show, but you would have probably seen the Dungeon Master somewhere. On this set you get the last six episodes. The I don't know, I can't really remember the behind the scenes stuff very well about how the show finished, but 
basically the premise of the show is they're trying to find their way out of Dungeons and Dragons world and find their way back home. But they never actually make it home, which is really disappointing. <laughs> I think there is a special feature somewhere on these discs that talks about that in more detail and maybe how they get home, I can't remember for sure. There's just something in the back of my head because I watched, I watched these when they came out 15, 16 years ago. And um, I remember watching all the episodes and I watched all the commentaries and I watched all the extras as well. I don't know why I sold my original copy. I think it's because I've actually watched this box set at least a couple of times and I had seen all the commentaries and stuff. Maybe I just thought I'm never going to watch it again for a while, so I thought I'd get rid of it. But recently, um, for some reason, it popped back into my head and I really wanted to own it again. It's out of print, so it's very hard to find. I was quite lucky finding this set on eBay. It wasn't too expensive, especially with like the unique case that it comes in. The first couple of discs are quite badly scratched in this set. The other two are a lot better, so I'm going to try and source another copy of the first two volumes. Luckily, I think those two are the most easily obtainable. Um, and if I can find another box to match this, I will, because it is a little beat up and I like my stuff in a little bit better condition. It wasn't packed very well, that damage was caused in the post. But uh, yeah, there's a few bashes on it. But yeah, a very nice set for a great TV show. If you like um, 80s cartoons, they're a little cheesy, but the stories are good. And they're only like 20, 25 minute episodes, so they're good for binge watching. And as I said, the extra content makes these DVDs invaluable if you love this show like I do. So yeah, let me know if you ever watched Dungeons and Dragons. I think it was quite well known at the time. So if you grew up in the 80s like I did, then you probably watched it. And other than that, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.